for 156 players at Lumine, the next six days could be career-defining. A ticket to the European Tour for 2018 awaits for the top 25 and ties at the end of what can only be described as one of the toughest tests in golf. As players get set to tackle the hills and lakes courses at the Spanish Resort, we've broken down the field, which includes aspiring pros looking to make the step up for the first time right up to a seven-time European Tour winner and also a Ryder Cup player. There will be 32 countries represented at Lumine this week. Perhaps unsurprisingly, England is the country with the most players in action with 33. Zimbabwe Scott Vincent, India Shibankar Sharma, Mexico Oscar Serena, Poland Adrian Moronk, Portugal Joseph Philippe Lima and Iceland Berger Haft Horsen have just one player each. For 24-year-old Adrian Moronk above, there's the opportunity for history to be made. Should he finish in the top 25 this week, he will become the first Polish player to have a full European Tour card. To highlight just how tough this final stage is, the field boasts a seven-time European Tour winner. His name is Gonzalo Fernandez Castano and he returns looking for his European Tour card after losing his status on the PGA Tour last season. He also has fellow Spaniard and three-time European Tour winner Alvaro Quiroz caddying for him this week. There are also two six-time European Tour winners in the field Simon Dyson and Niklas Fast. Dyson's last European Tour win came way back in 2011, while Fast's most recent success was more than 10 years ago in 2006. Did we also mention a Ryder Cup player that's Oliver Wilson below? The Englishman was selected by Sir Nick Faldo as a captain's pick for the 2008 match at Valhalla and has one European Tour win to his name at the 2014 Alfred Dunhill Lynx Championship. In total, there are 11 players with more than one European Tour win in the field. They are Gonzalo Fernandez Castano 7, Simon Dyson 6, Niklas Fast 6, Ricardo Gonzalez 4, Johan Edfors 3, Richard Green 3, Henny Otto 3, Anders Hansen 3, Simon Kahn 2, Julian Kesney 2 and Alejandro Canaziras 2. Remember Jin Jung the 2010 amateur champion and open silver medalist he's vying to get his European tour back after a disastrous 2016 season where he failed to make the cut in a single event, almost a third of the field 46 will be made up of Brits. That includes 33 Englishmen, 9 Scots, 2 Northern Irish players and 2 Welshmen, at 6 feet 9 inches. Jonathan Thompson is comfortably the tallest player in action at Q School. Should he gain his card, he would also become the tallest player on the European Tour 3 inches taller than 6 feet 6 inches Chris Wood, and finally, just a wee word of warning. At last year's Q School, only 3 of the 30 players who earned their cards for the 2017 season went on to keep them. They were Eddie Pepperell, Eduardo Molinari and Ashley Chesters.